Hey y'all, Curtis again. Hey, this is the zoysia grass I planted. I put down two bags, five pounds each, which is each bag contains 10% seed after I, with the rest of it's all mulch. And the mulch isn't, the, isn't coating the seed. So, I mean, there's actually literally 10% seed and the rest is like inert matter. And each bag says it only covers 1,000 square feet. Well, I put it down in a 6,000 square foot and it's been in for two months since July 2017 here to September 2017 and it's really thick and it's come up very sparse very very sparse and then I mean it's this here is like was like 90% this is 90% better than what it was when it first came up I mean it's really spreads pretty fast but it, it is a slow growing grass tall lengthwise um, the height of the grass doesn't grow very fast, which is nice if you don't want to mow a whole lot But it's very fast spreading. I mean, it was like I couldn't believe how fast it spread it spread just as fast as almost as my Bermuda did And it's thickening up a little bit of weeds. I mean I sprayed weeds twice and it didn't hurt the zoysia grass Got to rake this uh, pine straw, but it's now getting in the fall where the pine straw falls off, but I watered this twice a day 30 minutes each time in each zone here and the sprinklers pretty much cover it all i got three sprinklers in a 6,000 square foot section and uh, if you can see is this is all that you see that's green is mainly grass now all the weeds are pretty much dead there's a few little spots of crab grass i'm gonna have to next spring put down some crabgrass preventer and then and then put down fertilizer and it'll really take off and thicken up good. There's a couple, I think there's another grass species in here mixed in. Bahia, I believe. And that Bahia is a really difficult to get rid of out of, a, out of your lawn. You have to use uh, M plus M. What is that? M, M plus S. M plus M. Mainer. There's another brand for it. Um, that's the only way to kill it without killing your zoysia. Or your centipede, there's a in the back is centipede and bahia, and I'm gonna spray that at Manor M plus M uh, back there to get rid of all the bahia grass. But yeah, I like the zoysia better than centipede. If I kill some of the centipede in the back, I'll just replant with zoysia grass because I really like the look of this zoysia grass. Looks a lot like tall fescue where I'm from, up in Wisconsin. But uh, living down south now, fescue just does not make it through the summer here unless you water the crap out of it. But that's my zoysia. Hoping, I was hoping to get it thicker this year, but it ain't gonna happen. It's about a two year process to get a nice thick lawn with any kind of grass you use. Uh, it's just time and diligence and putting in the effort, watering and fertilizing and stuff like that. Well, thanks for watching.